So I thought I was recording a video, but it didn't work. Anyway, welcome to Judy's Crafts and Stuff. I'm Judy. I'm going to try again. I haven't been here in a while because I've been dealing with some health issues, but I'm starting to feel like myself again. And I even went out today and mowed part of my yard with my battery-operated lawnmower, which I really love because it's lightweight. I don't have to crank it. don't have to get gas. just have to do a little bit at a time, which is fine because that works for me and my back. So, anyway, I haven't had a whole lot to share yarn-wise, but I thought I'd just get on here today and say hello. And I hope this video is working. According to the number there, it's still running. So anyway, I thought I would share this um, project. It's still a UFO. I'm using Hot Pooling Red Heart Super Saver Pooling Yarn. It seems like the color is called Hot, H-A-U-T-E, Pooling but it's red, black, white, and gray. I just love that color combination. And uh, like I said, it's still a UFO. It's coming along slowly, but I like the way the colors work out. It's probably gonna be a lapgan or a shawl, something like that. Also, a while back I purchased a pack of bonbon yarns from Amazon, and I'm gonna show them here. Hello, this is a package of uh, little bonbons of yarn that I purchased from Amazon quite some time ago. They're by Mira Handcrafts. This was a package of 40, and each one is uh, 10 grams, 22 yards, 20 meters, and they're size 3. So I've decided I'm going to make some granny squares, see how far I can get with each of these colors, and then line it with... Um, I mean, go around it with white, and then join them together with some other color. It's quite a collection here. I haven't decided how many squares I'm going to make, but most of these colors had two of each color. Or more. So, so anyway, that's the project I'm going to start next. Okay, so... <clears throat> Interestingly, I was going to make uh, granny squares out of them. I thought I'd just take each one and make as big of a granny square as it would make and uh, then sew them together. However, they came out different sizes. Couldn't exactly get them right together. I used the same uh, hook. It's a size 7, which is a cross between a G and an H. It's a 4.5 millimeter where G is 4 millimeters and H is 5 millimeters. It, anyway, so I used the same crochet hook for each one, but I got different sizes. I think my tension was correct. This one, this red one came out much bigger than, say, this yellow one. So I said, okay, I don't, don't guess that's going to work with granny squares. I guess when you do a granny square project, you should use the same yarn for all the, or the same brand of yarns, not the same color maybe, for all the squares if you want them all to be equal. So anyway, I started decided to just put it together in a thing like this. I don't know what this is going to be. Maybe it'll end up being some kind of a wearable because that width is about the right size for either the front or the back for me for a top. So I don't know when are those things going to happen. A couple days ago, I woke up in the morning and I said, I think I'll just get my hair cut today. So I called up Walmart. It was 10.30 in the morning. They said, would you like an appointment? I said, sure, how about 11 o'clock? So I went up there and there was uh, two beauticians working and one customer. So I got my hair cut and that was great. It's the first time I had my hair cut professionally in about 10 years. It's so much better than that long thing I was dealing with. And I'm sure they did a much better job than I did of cutting my own hair. So anyway, <clears throat> That's about all I had to share today, and I hope y'all are doing great. I hope you're having a wonderful day. It's only 79 degrees here in Virginia, and uh, it's almost noon. So I feel like it's just the most beautiful day of all, the last day of June, June 30th, 2022. And um, looking forward to the rest of the summer. Um, you all have a wonderful day, wonderful week, and I'll talk to you again soon. Take care.